I want to thank you because you all are the ones who are really um, treating people who are um, who need who need help um, in ways that respect them, listen to them, help them um, more than anybody else in our courthouses. Uh, as I said before, most people who experience um, courthouses are there because something has gone wrong and. And things go wrong in, in their housing situations, in their businesses, um, sometimes they're victims of crime, um, sometimes they're charged with crimes. Um, but I can't think of anything more um, stressful or devastating um, than your family separation or your, your family splitting up and what, and what happens and what's gonna happen next and anything more unsettling. So the people that you are dealing with, the people that you are delivering justice to um, are, are in crisis. Um, you know that better than I do, and it seems to me, I, as far as I can tell, you have like 25,000 jobs, right? You're like jugglers, you're therapists, you're counselors, you're accountants, you're investigators, you're mediators, you're, you, you, you are called upon to do uh, 30,000 things um, every single day, and you do it, and you do it with kindness, and you do it with compassion, and you do it um, in a way that really um, is why we get those surveys, surveys every year saying people have trust in our government. It's because how they are treated by you. So I am incredibly grateful to you for, for your service to families in their most difficult moments um, and for, for, what you, for, for how you are um, ambassadors for, for our branch.